Hi yeah, guys, welcome to plot number 12. I'm Jay, and well this is plot number 12. What have we got going on today? Well, I want to try and get the glass in the greenhouse. I've got loads of the two foot by two foot squares, and not as many of the two foot by 18 inch rectangles, and I need to cut some of the squares into rectangles, but I'm not quite sure how many that I need. So, I'm going to crack on with what i got, and then when I get to the point where I run out of rectangles, I'll have to start cutting them. Uh, catch you in a bit. So I've just got one side of the roof done. Start that again, eh? So I've just got one side of the roof done. Uh, it's slow going, you know, working with the glass and that. But I thought it's getting there. Went to do the other side, and the first piece of put in, it just wouldn't sit right. It was along the bottom. It had been cut sort of at a triangle. You know, it had been cut not straight. So gets another piece of glass, tries that one, exactly the same. Takes a step back, looks at the frame, um, yeah, we're not square, we were nowhere near square. So I've had to go along, undo all the anchoring bolts along the bottom, and knock the frame back round, try and square it up. Uh, I'll give you a quick look now. Yeah, so this was the piece that we noticed the frame was on the cock, and if you looked up the upright to the roof, you could see it by eye how far out it was. Like you see down at the floor, we're going to have to try and move the base over a bit. We can get the glass in and mess about with that from the inside out, try and get out of this wind. So uh, I'll crack on getting this side of the roof done and I'll catch up. So as you can see there, all the anchor bolts are out. I've loosened all the ones along that side, along the front and along the back. I've pushed the frame round now so that the glass fits in it. Well, that's how far off we were, so I'm going to have to try and get under the base and move the base back a bit. Right guys, it, it's done. Uh, yeah, it's a day later. Uh, I just cracked on yesterday. Got it done. It's a slow enough job doing the glass anyway, being careful with it all. So, uh, yeah, just took my time with it. Come, what was it? it was about five o'clock when we'd finished last night. It's just, you know, starting to lose the light. But no, I got it done. It's all up. And uh, yeah, I made up with it. Glass one's cleaning. It's absolutely filthy. But uh, yeah, other than that, it's good to go. So I'm just looking down the plot. Now the greenhouse is up and it, it's sort of finally all coming together. I envisioned it and how I wanted it. Obviously, there's quite a few more jobs to be doing. But the initial layout is there now, so yeah, I'm made up with it. So guys, I'm just going to pot on the peppers and the one chilli that germinated. Uh, I usually have to pot on quite early, is where I have the heated propagator in the garage. It's an east-facing east -facing window. That it sits on so it doesn't get a lot of light so stuff goes leggy quite quick in there once germinated so i got it potted on and then moved into the house on the south facing shelving that i've got set up on the back windows um uh, yeah so these first ones these are the mini bell yellows it should be small mini bell peppers uh decent germination rate on these uh, we're just putting them in to save again, just serve multi purpose with a bit of a mic light mixed in with it. If you've not noticed his hands by now, the little fellow was giving us hand to do these. These next ones that we're on to, these are the Robertinas. Uh, this should be just like your average sort of size pepper. Same again with these, decent germination rate. Just using a fork just to prise them out. There's, did we put one at no, there? We put two, yeah, two or three seeds in each module. Most have came up with two in, so decent turnaround with them. 
Just labelling them all up now. Right now that's the peppers out the way all potted on. Uh, I'm just going to get some brassica seeds sown. Uh, in here we've got some kohlrabi, some calbreece, some purple sprouting, some cauliflower and I've got some beetroot too to go in. Uh, all from Premier Seeds Direct again, except the beetroot. Uh, the missus picked that up from somewhere the other day because we forgot to order any. So yeah, it's all seed and potting compost. A little bit of a mix of light mixed in. Fill the tray, a little indentation. Uh, three or four seeds multi sown in there. There's plenty of them in each of the packets. Uh, cover them over. And yeah, we'll leave them, let them go, get them in the heated propagator. Cheers for all watching. Uh, I'm made up with how the greenhouse has turned out. Uh, so I just got to get all the glass cleaned, get a potting bench in there, and sort out the layout. I don't know if it's just do one long bed down one side and have a potting bench to full length for the other side. Uh, before we can sort that whenever we're ready. So uh, yeah, cheers for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and all that. Uh, I'll see you in the next one.